So finally, guys, I got my hand on the all-new Xiaomi Smart Band 8. This is the latest iteration of the famous Xiaomi Smart Band. And we know that this is one of the world's number one wearables from Xiaomi. And let's see what this thing can do. Hey guys, it's me, Mitch Tobolo2 of Xiaomi Review, and welcome back to my channel. So this is the Xiaomi Smart Band 8 from Xiaomi, and this just released last April in China, and we haven't seen any news for global release. And this one most likely would be the same for global release. So we can see some specs here at the back. AMOLED display, 100 plus sports mode, a brother switching level. It has extended battery life, sports mode. It is quick charging, and, and this one can withstand 5 ATM underwater. So inside the box, we have a user guide. We have your charging cable. And we have the smart band itself. So what I have here is the light gold color and there's another color, of course, the all black. So you can see the strap is quite different this time around. It's no longer the wrap around type that we see in Xiaomi Band 7 and below. This time we can see it's a quick release one. All you need to do is just clip it here or just press button to release. It's fast and easy to use. One of the added features this one is that you can clip it on your necklace. I'm not quite sure what kind of attachment, but we will see it soon. The strap is made out of good material, so wearing on your wrist is good and comfy, not itchy. At the back, we can see the sensor as well as the charging terminal. Charging here is very easy. All you need to do is clip it here and you're ready to charge. So by far, this is the default watch face. So the latest Xiaomi Smart Band model offers a 1.62 inch AMOLED display and it's always on display. So as we can see it also in the Xiaomi Smart Band 7. This one has a 192 by 490 pixel. And what's nice on this one, it has a 60 hertz of refresh rate as well as 600 nits of max brightness. So this Smart Band features everything that the Xiaomi Smart Band 7 has with some minor twitches. But what I like about this band is it's very elegant, very easy to wear, and it looks nice on my wrist. Putting on my wrist is very easy. All I need to do is just uh, strap it around. Pull it and yeah, I'm good to go. Now this is the default watch face. In order to change, just hold and swipe, swipe. And there's a lot of watch face you can try. How about let's try this one. Swiping over to the left, you can see your uh, sleep monitoring, your heart rate. Sleep monitoring, you can of course click it like this. Heart monitoring, it looks something like this. Then you have your weather report. Then you can control your music on your phone. Then you also have Alipay and WeChat Pay. This is for Chinese models only. And this is some quick access menu. Checking the settings, you have all of these things that you need to calibrate. Running mode, band display, display, vibration, do not disturb, and everything you need to do here. Even reboot. Swiping down, you can see all of the notifications here. Swiping up, you have all of the menus like stats, workout, activity, running, uh, status, your heart rate, your vitality, uh, blood oxygen level, sleep monitoring, stress monitoring, uh, weather report, alarm, uh, WeChat Pay, Alipay settings, and more. These are what you can see for more. Quickly checking our stats. This is what I have for today. And swiping down, you can see everything in breakdown format. Now checking all the workout modes. There's a lot of the workout modes you can see here. Now this smart band can last me up to 16 days with regular usage and up to six days for always on display, turn on, and everything monitoring, always turn on. Now, in order to connect it, you can download the Mi Fitness app, and everything you can calibrate it here. It's very easy to use. Uh, you can see all of your statistics here. You can log in your workout modes. You can see your um, sleeping pattern, your heart rate, your step monitoring, and everything is here. It's very easy to check on your smartphone. You can also customize some of your uh, exercise here. And you can manage some of your band display over here. To download, just uh, press this one and press apply. It will install. Now my watch face looks a lot more refreshing. Now you can also calibrate some of the uh, app notification, incoming calls. You can also see your heart rates over here. You can even turn it to, into a camera shutter button on your wrist and a lot more. Now you can also join in some competition and challenges should you want. Now, what can I say about the Xiaomi Smart Band 8? It's a really refreshing design and the strap is looking nice. Now, probably one of the downside that I can see from this one is that if you're upgrading from the Xiaomi Band 6 or 7, you can no longer use the wraparound strap on this one. But on the upside, you can turn this into a necklace or you can even put it on your shoe. 
you just simply need to buy some attachment for that. There's two versions of this one. The regular one comes at around $34, and the NFC variant would come at around $40. I would suggest that you wait for the global variant of this one, the Xiaomi Smart Band 8, and probably there would be a pro version coming out pretty soon. If you like this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, and of course, hit that bell icon so you don't miss any future uploads here from my channel. And so I'm Mitch Tobolo2, and you're watching Xiaomi Review. And I'll see you on the next one.